The National Labor Relations Act imposes a duty on an employer to bargain in good faith with a union representing its employees regarding wages, hours, and other employment conditions. May an employer negotiate to take some of these subjects off the table? That's the question in National Labor Relations Board versus American National Insurance. American National Insurance began negotiating a labor agreement with the union representing its office employees. The union's proposed contract included a clause submitting all grievances to arbitration. American objected to unlimited arbitration and proposed instead a management functions clause permitting American to make unilateral decisions about certain issues. The proposed clause specified that certain matters, including promotions, discipline, and scheduling, were management's responsibility and excluded from arbitration. After lengthy negotiations, the parties couldn't agree on American's proposed clause, but agreed on other contract terms. The union filed charges with the National Labor Relations Board. The board held that American's insistence on the management functions clause constituted a per se violation of its duty to bargain in good faith. The board's order prohibited American from negotiating for the right to take unilateral action regarding wages, hours, and other employment conditions. The Fifth Circuit reversed. The United States Supreme Court granted cert.